here with uh, Sensei Nick Doherty. Um, you know, he's awesome. He runs a big school over there in New Jersey, and he's our director of social media for Champions Way. Uh, today, he's going to be sharing all his secrets for uh, bully prevention uh, and other some other amazing things for you guys. So, please, uh, without further ado, uh, Sensei Nick, um, we're excited to have you here, and uh, let's get going. Thanks so much, Sean. And a big shout out to Sean Jimenez, our director of marketing. I uh, love working with Sean. We've been working together for several years now. And we're really lucky to have you uh, on the team. He's our director of marketing. Um, he'll be at the Seaway speaking. Definitely want to make sure you, you don't miss his class. Um, he's getting tremendous amount of leads online. So uh, definitely make sure we're going to go over some of the things at the Seaway. And uh, today's presentation, we'll be going over Bully Awareness Month. And more importantly, pretty much uh, how to do, showing you how we do everything. Uh, the most common question I get all the time from a lot of people is, I'm not getting enough leads. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't get enough traffic to my website. And you know, there's a lot of different methods. Um, I specialize on content marketing and g giving things of value that would actually drive people to your website or to your online presence. So I think this webinar will demonstrate exactly what you should be doing uh, in order to get more traffic. And one thing I want you to take away from this webinar is you have to give to get. You just can't expect to get leads just because you want leads. It just doesn't work like that. So keep in mind that uh, everything I'm going over today is all powered by Perfect Mind. Um, and basically, uh, if you're not a Perfect Mind user, you can get some more information afterwards. But a little bit about our company before we get started. Our headquarters is in Vancouver, British Columbia. If you haven't been to the Champions Way office, I highly recommend going there. Uh, it's an amazing experience. Uh, our CEO, Mr. Fareed Dordar, uh, Sean Jimenez. Uh, we have some amazing people there, Vahid Shababi, and over 60 employees. And I actually run the office located in Jersey. It's a smaller office. We have about seven staff members here. And if you'd like to follow us on any of our social platforms about our events that are upcoming, uh, Facebook is always one of the best ways, Twitter, YouTube. We also have the world's uh, largest online community at uh, community.championsway.com. You can check that out. Um, before we get started, the Seaway, if you haven't heard about the Seaway, that is our big event that we host in Anaheim, California, which I highly recommend for you to attend. Uh, and just to go through it quickly, uh, a lot of people are asking who's going to be speaking. And let's just check, take a look at this lineup of exactly what's going to be going on. It's pretty impressive. Uh, morning workout with Master Ace Ramirez for crew Muay Thai kickboxing. That's a, just a, a basic workout you know, to get the day started. And then we have Professor Flavio Albeda, um, just an amazing martial artist and, and, and business owner himself. Uh, Master Tom Kalos, I mean, you know, needs no introduction on martial arts leadership. Master Ace will be doing a seminar on keys to retention. Uh, the opening ceremony and keynote will be from Master Fareed. Sean the Shark will be going over SEO for martial arts schools, so definitely make sure you make that class. Uh, then we're having a basic roundtable, and then myself and Ricardo Almeida will be doing a class on content marketing. Ricardo is one of my good friends, and uh, we work together on a lot of different projects. Um, and then we finish the night off with a workout from world champion Robert Drysdale. So, I'm not sure if you've seen any types of days like this, but that's a pretty amazing day, you know, first day, uh, the people you're working with. So uh, if you need more information, you can check that out. Uh, then the next morning, Fabio Leopolda, uh, he, another world champion Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu stylist, uh, 7.15 in the morning workout. Our new PM3 software training, that will be with Nima, our director of customer service. Free Boers, okay, designing curriculum and the culture of your school. He's, an amazing, he's a pioneer of the martial arts. I'm sure everybody knows him runs one of the most successful schools in the, on the West Coast, over, I think, sixty dollars or $70,000 a month. You want to make sure you tr uh, check that out. Master Melody Schumann, okay, she'll be there as well, one of my good friends, and she does an amazing job with the little ones, so definitely check that out. We're not done yet. We still have even more amazing things going on. Dave Kovar, Kiyoshi, okay, on retention. Whatever he's talking about, you know, his classes are amazing. And finally, Roland Osborne, income generation through camps. So this is a, you know, a, a packed lineup of speakers and then at the end, you get to do a 30-minute Q&A with all of us. Uh, ask us any questions you want. Um, and then we also, like I said, we're having perfect mind training at the same time. And I think when I show you some of the things that we're doing through perfect mind today, uh, if you're not already using it, it's something you definitely want to look into. So that is the C-Way. So there's a list of our speakers. And if you'd like to visit martialartsconvention.com, you can go there and register and get more information on the C-Way. Uh, to keep up with us, the, the best ways to keep up with us are on Facebook, okay? And you can go to facebook.com slash championswayfans. And then uh, for myself, facebook.com slash senseinickd. Uh, Twitter, twitter.com slash championsway. And for myself, twitter.com slash sensei underscore nick. And that's the best places to keep up with us for all of our upcoming events, 
webinars, promotions, marketing, anything. So check us out there. Uh, I wanted to get started first today with uh, an amazing martial artist and friend and client, uh, Anthony DiCarlo. And this gentleman is uh, just you know crushing this bully awareness seminar. Uh, you could Facebook him yourself to see what the things that he's doing. But this was a little testimonial that he gave us uh, because he's been on this since the beginning. And now it's really going out of control like uh, to the point where he just has so many people coming in and uh, his Facebook page is blowing up. And you know this is what you need to do in order to drive traffic and, and to build more awareness about your brand or your business. So the thing is, people obviously see that he cares because he was bullied as a child. And he had pictures and videos up of things that happened to him. And now it's, you know, it's basically, I'm not going to say it's going viral, but it, it's building a tremendous amount of awareness. And he's getting a lot of traffic. And you know, he, obviously he cares and he's passionate about the cause or the crusade. So a lot of people are coming. You know, and this is something I highly recommend. Check it out. So for those of you not taking a, uh, the bully awareness seriously, you are missing the boat. I have newspapers visiting my academy next Friday. Two state officials may be there and a news crew. I got ahead of the game and had a write-up done last month on teaching more than martial arts in schools today. Also, I was bullied as a kid, and my Facebook story had over 300 likes and 50 comments, over 15 shares. And that is, that's just an amazing number right there. For those of you who don't know, you know, to get you know, over 100 likes on a Facebook post, it takes a lot. Of, it takes a lot. Uh, to get 50 comments and over 15 shares, 300 likes, that's a, just an amazing uh, job by uh, Sensei DiCarlo. So Sensei, props. Uh, the bigger, this is bigger than life, and I have a special thanks to Sensei Nick, Sensei Brooklyn, and Champions Way for all the devotion to this program. Please don't miss out. To hear more about what Anthony DiCarlo is doing, please just Facebook friend request him. He's always on Facebook, and uh, you know you can send him a message. And Anthony, thank you so much for allowing us to put this up here, and congratulations on your success so far. Um, so four things actually that I'm going to be going over today. It says five. One of them is I'm going to show you. I, I didn't add it to the slide here, but it's pretty cool. I think you're really going to enjoy it the most. So it's like a little secret surprise. So the first thing is the bully awareness checklist. And for those of you that have already seen this, it's OK, but we're going to review it again. The bully awareness marketing collateral, the how-to, which I think, I think a lot of people need to pay close attention to because a lot of people come to the webinars and then they don't really know what to do. So I'm going to be going through some of the key things on how to do it. And then basically from there, it would be best to watch the recordings of how to do this. Working together, and what we're trying to do is like you know Anthony DiCarlo is getting a lot of support and Grandmaster Charafella and other uh, people that are involved in this, everyone is supporting one another to get as much exposure as possible and kind of working together. So that's what we're going to talk about a little bit as well. So let's start first with the bully awareness checklist. And I'm really big on checklists and having you know clear object object objectives for my staff. So bully awareness month overview. OK, what are you trying to do here? Bully awareness month is a crusade of individuals, organizations, and leaders who are interested in helping anyone who's bullied witnesses bullying or is a bully. As our society is distracted with television, media, and online poison on how to behave, we must spread the message to our youth on how to be respectful, positive, and polite. Uh, if you look at most television channels and you know, anything that's on TV anymore, it's all about conflict, drama, and just, you know, just telling everybody to go after, you know, go after yourself. And that, that's just not the way it should be. And uh, we, can't, we, know, we don't want our children watching things like that. We want to, you know, in the martial arts schools, concentrate on character development. So, while the most media is about bad news, negative propaganda, we have the tools and freedom to help spread positive messages. Think of it as like a secret online. So we hope that we could all work together to make as many possible, as ma make as many people as possible aware that bullying has a terrible effect for years on individuals. And if we come together, we kind of will make a difference. That's more of like our mission statement. And I think that if you, if you have that type of mindset, you're going to see tremendous results. Uh, as, as the, uh, the thing I'm, I'm preparing to is someone that calls up and says, I need to get students from bully prevention. Well, you know that's okay. I understand you need to get more students, but not having the right mindset, you're not going to get students. It's like the laws of attraction. It's like the message you're putting out. People know that you really don't care about helping children. That you just want to get people in the door so you can tell them at the end you have a six-week special for $99. This is not going to cut it. So, the checklist again. Let's review this. Offer a bully awareness workshop at your location on a weekly basis. Okay. Uh, post a bully awareness month on Facebook page. Business page, Google Plus page. I'm going to even show you how to do that. Some people um, just need some assistance. So at the end of the webinar, I'll be showing you how to just put those basic banners um, on Facebook and on Google Plus. Uh, those are included for our Champions Way library members. And then we have other uh, content that is only for SMO clients. Uh, post bully awareness tips on Pinterest. If you're not on Pinterest yet, you're missing the boat. Um, when people talk about traffic, 
Okay, if you're not in the right places, then you can't. Ex you shouldn't expect to get that much traffic. Pinterest is the number one referral traffic generator. It generates more traffic than YouTube, Twitter, and Google Plus combined. And it's mostly women. And moms are the ones that want to get their children involved in sports. So we actually have the content for you to help you, you know, utilize Pinterest and drive traffic back to your website. Contact Youth PTA about offering a free bully awareness seminar for school systems. Contact Boy Scouts and Girl Scout troops in your area about offering a free bully awareness workshop. Get students and parents to make videos on effects of bullying and or experiences with bullying and promote in all their networks. So getting them to, you know, to tell, show people what's going on in their lives and things that are happening to them. Uh, social sharing, get uh, com uh, commitments from students and leads to share all the comments. Like, let them share it and let it go, you know, everybody working together. Offer Google Plus Hangout for people that are, uh, and children that are bullied. Uh, this is a really, what you could do is you can use the PowerPoint that we provided in the library. And basically in there, you could use that PowerPoint and you could invite people to come in, parents, families. That's the, you know, that's the really the money-making, you know, part of the martial arts school, families and children. Okay, and you know, people that are actually you're actually making a major difference and impact in their life, having them come to a Google Plus workout, you know, or a Google Plus hangout, and uh, show, you know, just going online and talking about it and letting them watch you and listen to you, this gets good exposure. And the good thing is, when people, when you're actually on Google Plus and you are, are doing a hangout, it'll say bully awareness workshop, and then people on Google Plus will see that, and then you can share it. You can show other networks that what you're doing, and then it creates traffic. So everything that we're doing is about getting more traffic. So if you're dead leads and you're not getting anything, and you know you're just doing the same old thing, this is the, this is the strategy uh, that we're we're helping everyone out with, and it will, this will definitely get you more traffic. Offer a free martial arts month for bullies and children that are bullied. So part of the the challenge is you know p children that are doing the bullying. You know we don't just want to help the kids that are getting bullied. You know it's okay to reach out to people and have them channel their energy instead of bullying people to actually you know, um, work with them and, and show them that they need to have self-control, discipline, focus through the martial arts. Uh, the hardest challenge you run into is their parents are probably, in most cases, not as supportive, but you know, it's a numbers game. If we can get to a couple of them and we can stop them and we can show them that it's not doing anything but negative things, uh, I think that we can get them involved with this as well. Visit, uh, visit every local school on foot and give them Bully Awareness Press Packet, which is a bully prevention kit. Uh, you know, going around, like you can't just, you know, expect to just go on Facebook and throw a post. It's just not going to cut it. So I hear the excuses that everyone's busy, you got to do this, you got to do that. If you want to really capitalize on this and build amazing, you know, community you know, awareness and get people in there, you have to, a crusade is different than just a promotion. A crusade is something that you do from the bottom of your heart that you're passionate about. So whether you can't do it, get someone out there to go on foot and go from school to school and tell everybody, or everybody in town about what you do. Blog every day about bullying for the next month. But this is one of the hardest ones because people just don't blog. A blog could be video blogs. It could be just talking about it, getting a, a video from another student, and you know, sharing that blog because these are the types of uh, blogs that get shared in comments. No one cares about your six-week special. No one cares about your free trial. No one cares about any of those things. No one really cares. Uh, people only care about things that relate to them and things that are you know, like things like this crusades. Uh, you know, women's self-defense, th things of that nature are the things that get shared and, and, and generate interest. You have to think about it. Like, you know, sharing, if you're going to share something, it's because you care about it and you think it could benefit others. Well, I understand that, you know, you might think a six-week special benefits others, but that's all over Facebook. That's all over everywhere. The specials and sign up for this and sign up for that. But when you're doing something like this, it's a different mindset. Everyone likes share and plus one, everyone who's part of, the, of what we're trying to do. That's a good idea as well. Make a daily video on bullying and promote all, all social networks. Sponsor any child that is bullied for one year if they are, are, are unable to afford lessons. And of course, you could change this if you want. Do give them six weeks, give them three weeks, give them two weeks, whatever you want to do. Share any content you make in bullying awareness library for others. Like we have other people that are starting to contribute ideas and suggestions in our library. Contact the police to see how they can help the fire department, the mayor. Anthony DiCarlo has the mayor involved in his crusade. Um, and then we have, is your child a bully ad? Well, I'll show you how that looks for people that are, you know, their child is a bully. Okay, maybe they know their child's a bully and they're seeking help, and no, there's no one out there that's promoting that. So we promote that, and maybe you'll get some leads from that. You know, not, not a lot of, some children or parents don't care, but some of them know their child are, are a bully, and they, they want to change that. Re-educate communication and relationships with children. Um, I was talking about this in my black belt class last night, and I explained to them, I said, you know, Guys, most of the, the black belts and the junior black belts in here, you guys were raised differently than I was. 
um, you know, when I was growing up, I had to wait and then maybe get a phone call and, you know, sometimes, uh, you know, just go, go visit my grandparents and I wouldn't even see them that much and, you know, it was like, you know, a big thing seeing people. Well, now everybody's texting, Facebooking, or, or the interactions a lot more, but the problem is it's a lot different. Uh, you know, face-to-face -face interaction and building relationships is nothing compared to social networking. Uh, people, you know, today have all, there's more social anxiety, right, because people, you know, are just hiding behind a computer versus shaking hands, looking someone in the eye. And I see that when I'm hiring people out here in New Jersey. You know, people are coming in, and it's like they're, they're just way behind when it comes to social interaction. I actually had a woman come in here with a, She was here for a job interview. She brought two of her friends with her. And I said, I'm sorry, um, are you guys all here for the job? She goes, no, they're my friends. And to me, thinking that someone would even do that, I just thought it was ridiculous. Another person is text messaging while I'm interviewing her. I mean, you know, that, that's just, you know, just not the way I was raised. You know, I, I know when I went into job interviews, my dad said never to do anything like that. So anyway, no text message week, okay? Um, text messaging, uh, to me, if I want to speak to Master Freed or Sean or anybody that's important to me, like, you know, once in a while it's okay to do a text. When I have something very important, I'll send an email, Master Freed, but we'll be able to speak tomorrow, uh, whatever time works for you, in regards to A, B, and C. And I want to at least talk to them on the phone. You know, we're going to webcam, and we've had uh, video conferences. Uh, you know, I don't want to just send them a text message because just saying one thing, it can be taken six different ways. Are you a bully and want to stop ad? How martial arts uh, helps children who are bullied? So the thing is, we're edu-selling people on why the martial arts is the activity that is why, you know, that is great for their children. And that's what it's all about. So, you know, you can't do it from the ad, just putting a word like confidence out there. Yeah, it's through content. So the bully awareness marketing collateral, let's go through that real quick. Uh, this is a sample of something that you you can put on Pinterest or Facebook or Google Plus uh, to promote that you're doing Bully Awareness Month. And I can guarantee you that if you put this up on Facebook versus a six-week special ad, you would not believe how many comments you get. I don't even know the people that are commenting. They see that this child's talking on a phone and you know he's getting bullied and he's crying. And and people have responded on my Facebook page that they remember those times that have happened that happened to their child. And they, they know, and it's just like the stories that are coming out of the woodwork are just unbelievable. And then what happens is other people see that, and then they start posting. And it just starts going, like, a, I don't want to say viral. It's not going viral, but it's getting way more awareness than your six-week special. So a bully prevention kit, you know, this is a big thing, and you can talk to anyone that's actually using it as part of our SMO package. This is working. Uh, look at this ad, a, a bully prevention kit. Bully prevention kit for parents, please click here for your free kit. You're giving them something, like a kit, a four-page PDF that explains to them everything they need to know about bullying or some basics, okay? And then from there, what happens is, you know, when I follow up with them and give them a call, you know, they're actually, I've given them something. I've given them something of value, and now they're actually interested in talking to me versus, you know, the, just doing a cold call and saying, oh, yeah, I saw, I saw you were here at a birthday party, and we want to see if you'd be interested in some information, you know, just because they filled out a list. You know, so those people really don't want to talk to you. The ones that want to train maybe, but most of them don't. And you know my students that go to other birthday parties. It's amazing what I see nowadays. Even when they when when they go to a birthday party in another school, uh, the instructors in their area are so rude and just like they have no ethics or any type of coof. They say, oh well, if, you know if you're unhappy or if you'd like to come train here, we offer better classes. You know again, you know not everyone has morals and ethics and you know studied in, in college about how to, to, to never badmouth your competition like that. But people do that kind of stuff. So if I give someone a kit, and I'm going to show you what the kit looks like in a little bit. That's going to break down that psychological barrier. I'm giving them something, and then they're going to be interested in coming into my school and maybe coming to a bully awareness workshop, and that's how you build relationships. They come in for the workshop. You hear about their stories. You tell them how they can help you. They go to a class, and then all of a sudden, Nick, I really like you. What do I need to do to get my son involved in this program? That's it. That's how it happens. So this is how you use the same one for Google+, and they plus one it, and then you could actually send them a message with the kit, or you could send them a link, either or. But what I do is I try to get plus ones and likes because that usually increases your out, you know, your edge rank on Facebook or even your ranking in Google. More plus ones, shares, and things like that. So that's why I, I want to do that, and then I can send them a link if they plus one it. It's really simple to do so. Uh, through, and then the same thing on Facebook. I could send them actually a link uh, through Facebook. But I want plus ones and likes because then other people are seeing it. That's important to know. So the Facebook banner. This is really simple, okay? But the Facebook banner. You basically save this to your desktop, and then you upload it. And for those of you that need uh, some help with that, I'll be showing that at the end, how to do that. Uh, this is the Google Plus banner, so that way everywhere I go, you know, Facebook, Google Plus, people are seeing this 
uh, and they're you know they're they're always thinking about it. It's like you know, they're seeing, if they ever go to my page, they're saying, "Wow, bully awareness, pretty cool." Uh, Facebook, here's the one. Instead of using the plus one, like for your free kit. And I know Mark Speranza and Ed Charfella, two of our clients that are having tremendous results with this. Um, and this is getting more exposure and more hype about their school. So that's that's a, you would add that just as an image. And I'm going to be showing people how to do that too. For those of you who don't know how to do it, it's pretty simple. So what is the bully prevention kit? What I did was, for all of our SMO clients, we provided a kit that's done for them, and it's, you really don't need to do anything with it. I recommend just using it the way it is, uh, and it, it's done. And all it is is basically a four-page PDF that talks about you know, what is bullying, the types of bullying, cyberbullying, bully prevention, bully response, bully prevention, and martial arts. So we started with, what is bullying? And there's mainly you know, a couple types of bullying, verbal, social, and physical. And parents read this, and they get interested, and they read about these different things, and then they understand what cyberbullying is, and examples of bullying, and then we go to the next page, prevention at home, prevention at school, okay? Adult response, stop bullying right away. What really happened if, it, if it's bullying? So this, these are just basic informational pieces that we give to them. And then martial arts, how does martial arts help? Through confidence, discipline, self-defense, and leadership. And it's just something very simple, and you don't have to go and give them a 75-page document, you know. But it's something that every month we're providing this content on different aspects of why the martial arts is beneficial to train. So infographs, okay, this is like these are very effective, especially on Pinterest, because instead of having an ad, you make it more of an infograph. So what is bullying? Making threats, spreading rumors, attacking someone, or physically, verbal, or verbally, exclusion. Is your child a victim? And then click here for 30 days free. Where does this take you? Back to your website. So if someone goes on Pinterest, they see this, they click this, it takes them to the 30-day trial, back to your website. That's traffic, okay? This is, the, this is the most effective way to drive people back to your school to, if you are looking for qualified leads. What is cyberbullying? Mean text and slash emails. Rumors through, rumors through email or social networking sites. Embarrassing pictures, videos. Is your child a victim? And same thing, driving them back to the website. So these infographs go, could go on Facebook. They really work well on Pinterest, and you know these these work very well. Uh, is your child a bully? Now we're we're trying to get people that are bullying. So a parent sees this. Yes, my child, you know, does. He instigates and fights with peers. Uh, does he feel a, a constant need to be in control? Okay. Uh, does he, does your child have a lack of respect? Does your child have a short temper? Martial arts teaches respect, discipline, and a sense of community. Enroll now now for your thirty day trial. All right, this is way more effective than, you know, just, again, the six-week special because we're focusing on education. And then free bully awareness seminars. You want to get groups involved? Here's another infograph. Girl Scouts, Boy Scouts, sports teams, elementary schools, middle schools, high schools. Book it now. Again, it takes them back to your website. They fill out a capture form, and you start booking people that want, are interested in doing this. If you can drive you know, between two to 3,000 people to your facility in a month, I mean, do the math. I mean, all right, so if you have a birthday party and you have one a week and you're getting 40 kids, all right, so let's just say 40, you're getting 100, 160 new people in there, you might get about maybe, let's just say, 10, 10 leads. Out of those 10 leads, you know, 50% conversion, you get, uh, let's just say, five. So now think about the numbers if you're getting 2,000 people visiting and seeing your website and they're hearing about the things you're doing. Okay, the numbers will speak for themselves. The enrollments will go up. And guess what? People that are not, are not ready to join now will remember you because you're going way above and beyond compared to everyone else that's just doing the same thing over and over again. So giving to get, in order to, they, this is like the kit right here, All right, and this person's going to get the kit, and then they're going to be more interested in you know, checking us out. So this is another uh, really cool feature I wanted to show you guys. Uh, the bully kit, what, what, you know, when you're speaking at seminars, at schools or other systems, uh, I'm sorry, schools or other events, okay, um, high school, elementary school, uh, or Girl Scout troop, or you're going to an after school program, whatever, okay? Uh, you know, this is something we use. Uh, it's very effective, more effective, uh, definitely than sending out flyers that just get thrown out. So, what we do is we took our kit and we put this on Perfect Mind, and this is pretty sick. You guys are really going to think this is awesome. So, you just did your seminar at the school, and I want to tell you guys, I'm going to say, okay, everybody, thank you so much. I hope everybody enjoyed it. And instead of looking like a salesperson, I'm going to say, I do have one more surprise for you, and it's a free bully kit. And in this kit, it'll tell you a little bit about bullying that you could review with your parents, and your parent or the parents are there; they can review it themselves, okay? And all you have to do is text "free kit," okay? I'm sorry, yeah, "free kit," or I'm sorry, it's "bull kit," "bully kit," uh, "bully kit" to seven two seven two seven, 
And, and when you see what that does, we're going to, at the end, in a couple minutes, I want to have everybody do that. You can see what I did. And it, it's, it's really cool. And it's all powered through Perfect. It's all, you know, I, I, I have everything through my website on Perfect Mind. It's really cool. So I want to have you check that out in a second. Now, another thing I could do also is I could send out something just like this, okay? And from here, basically, people will get it, and it will look exactly like that. So I could send this out to everyone that opts in to my mobile, you know, text message. So if I'm doing one of these events and I have, you know, a thousand people there, and I say, all right, guys, for for the re free bully prevention kit, because again, I don't I don't want to say for the free lesson, okay? But what I do is when they get this, when they opt in to bully kit to seven two seven two seven, they get the bully prevention kit, and they also get an option for a two week free trial. So we're going to come back to that in a second. But this is the same image that I uploaded, and you can check that out as well. Okay, no worries, Sean. So I'll, I'll review that with everybody. So we're going to do a little test. So, and then here's another one, too, that you can do for Bully Awareness Month, okay, for seminars. So if somebody would like to book a seminar, this can go out to people as well, all right? Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to help everybody out. I'm going to show you exactly what I'm talking about. And if you're in Canada, I'm sorry, I'm not sure if this is going to work. I know it works in the U.S. So take out your iPhone or your Galaxy or whatever device you're using. Let's take that out real quick, okay? And, and John Hackleman, uh, yes, questions will be at the end, sir. So just uh, I just got your text message while I'm going on my phone to help everybody with this, but text messages, uh, I'm sorry, questions at the end. So basically from here, what I want you guys to do is go to like the little the little box that would say two, okay? And under uh, on two, that's the number you text. So you're texting seven two seven two seven, all right? And then the message is bully kit with a space. So you're going to type in bully, okay? And then it's going to say kit, and there's a space bully space kit. And text that real quick, and when you see this, this is all really insane, uh, pretty cool, uh, and I, this is all on my website that I did, okay? So give it a second, and wait till the message comes back, you're going to see two messages, okay? So give it a second here. So the first one says, for our free kit, and there's a bit.ly link, we're going to click that. And then while you're clicking that, another message is going to come through. So I click that, and let's see where it takes me to. Let's check it out. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? Now, what I did was I basically put this onto my Perfect Mind website, and it says Free Bully Prevention Kit. Click here. All right? So I'm going to click that. Just click on the link, and you'll see it takes me right to the Bully Prevention Kit. Now, I didn't have a lot of time to you know, download this and make it, add all the pages, but I want to show you how simple it is to do something like this. Okay? And this is all through Perfect Mind. So, and then the best part is, guys, is that when people, if I wanted to do a form or anything like that, I didn't, add, I didn't add all the pages, but I wanted to show you how simple it is. Okay? So then that's like the page one. I didn't add page one, two, three, and four. I was trying to show everybody how this works. Now, the cool thing with this is that when basically people, you know, when, when they get this kit uh, and they're checking it out, literally about, a, you could do it, you could, uh, within a minute, they're going to get another text message that's going to offer them a two-week free trial. All right? So you'll see it, it should come through in a second, in about another minute. It'll say for a two-week free trial of our character development pro program. All right, and then when you get that, that'll show you, it's, it says basically it's a form that will say, you know, uh, I think I, I had it as a free week. I used like the, the wrong link, but it's a, you'll see what it, what it looks like on my end. So that is, how, that is how that works. So again, if you're utilizing something like this, if you're doing everything else we're talking about, and you're doing these demonstrations in the school systems, good luck with handing flyers out. Good luck. Okay? If you want to get people in, that's the best way to do it. So you can do something like that, and that is really a sharp thing, and it's all powered by Perfect Mind. Now, SMO clients, don't worry. Uh, I will be doing uh, that tomorrow, showing you guys how to exactly set that up. All right, it's very simple. All right, it's a little more advanced than some of the other stuff we're doing, but that is the first part of what we're trying to do. All right, so that is how you do the text messaging. And one thing that's pretty cool is we're going to do, let me see here. Okay, the how-to. This is one of my favorite sections. All right, now what I'm going to do, guys, is uh, there's probably a lot of questions on how to do some of this stuff. Uh, so I'm going to show you some of the basic ones on how to do it, all right, like how to upload the Facebook banner. I'll, I'm going to show you my website so you can check it out and all that stuff. So let me just uh, minimize this real quick. Get rid of this highlighter. Okay, and there you should have just got the for the two free week trial, should have just came through. And I'm always talking about character development. So you click that link. I just got mine. I'm, I'm sure you guys got yours too. And then, you know, from here, I had a, a basic page on my website for a free trial, and it says, click here to receive a free trial class. And you click that, and that's how you capture the person's information. 
So I like the fact that you actually get a bully prevention kit, and they're like, wow, this is cool. Now, what I did not do with the bully prevention kit that I will do, and I will show everybody on SMO how to do this, is that I will make it mobile. Okay, that is the awesome part of Perfect Mind, is that you know you, the first couple messages were great, that you saw the first image, but I didn't have the time to put that into a mobile, uh, so that way when people go to their cell phone, it's opening up just like that form at the end for the free lesson. Uh, that is the best part about Perfect Mind, whether they're checking it from a desktop or a mobile version, that we're able to differentiate, and that is so critical when it comes to mobile marketing. So that is, that is one huge, tremendous advantage of using Perfect Mind. Okay, so let's go on to the next section here, which is how to. I think everybody's going to like this. Let me just minimize this real quick. All right. Okay, so what I'm going to go over first is basically the, the most simple things. Let's go to Facebook, and I'll, I'll, I'll show you my page right now. And if everyone could just hold off and sending me a message for just or uh, any type of Facebook message for a couple minutes while I'm doing this. So here's my Champions Martial Arts page, and this is my this is there's my banner. It's just very simple. Okay. Um, and if you want to add stuff to it, that's that's your call. Like you could add, you know, if you want to add a logo or if you want to add something, that's fine. But all you're going to do is, um, you know, when you go to the library, you save the the, uh, the ad right on your desktop. So here's like this is one of them over here. Here's my Facebook cover. So let's preview that real quick. So this is it. This is there's my image. Okay, this is the Facebook banner. All right. Now this is really simple, but um, I guess just make sure everybody knows how to do it. So I go over here to change cover. Okay, change cover. And I don't want to choose from my photos because that's, those are my Facebook photos. I want to use upload photos. Okay, so upload photos, and then I would just go to my desktop and find the image, the Facebook banner, which is right here. There you go, Facebook Bully Awareness banner. And it's already in there, and that is how you would do it. Uh, pretty simple, but just want to make sure everybody understands how to do that. So, And then what you want to do is, after you've done that, like you'll see what I did here. I, I, just, I click on it, and what you want to do is you want to tag some people. Okay, I didn't actually. I didn't do that on this one. I think I did it for Champions Way. Let's check a look at Champions Way's page. Uh, but what you want to do is just tag people because that gets you know. Then it shows up on their page. And let me show you here. So let's go to Champions Way's page because we're promoting this as well. Master Freed and Sean are doing a lot of things in Vancouver at the Champions uh, School, so they're promoting it as well. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so let's go here. And here's here's that same banner. And what I did was I tagged people. So if you look at this. I think I tagged about 37 others. So if you look at this real quick, let's just move this out of the way. There we go. Um, 66 people liked it and nine shares, and that's pretty good. That's pr that's pretty good. But if you looked at actually some of my other photos when we first started doing this for Champions, I just want to show you something. Sean actually witnessed this too, and he was really surprised about it. When we first started promoting the uh, Say No to Bullying, okay. Look at that. 309 likes, 38 shares, okay. Now, if you have a post that's got anything close to that, uh, I'd be very surprised. All right, unless you are Ricardo Almeida, John Hackelman, legends of the martial arts, whatever. Uh, you know, that put up. They could say that they're you know just running and, and they'll get a hundred likes. But in most cases, we're not celebrities. So the reason why is because this is everyone's interested in this. It, everyone relates to it. So that's why it gets you tremendous you know feedback and people are interested in that. So our Facebook page alone, just for in the past month of doing this. We've seen tremendous results and way more traffic. So let's go to Google Plus now. Okay, so I'm going to go into Google Plus and let's log over here and go to my Champions page. So I'll go over here and here's my Google Plus page. Hopefully, you got, hopefully your school's on Google Plus. All right, for a search engine position and getting getting higher rankings. All right, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to my pages and let's check out my Champions Martial Arts Academy page. Okay, and there is my banner. Now, how do I do that? Same thing as Facebook. It's very simple. All right, so change photo cover, and then you go to upload, and you select your photo from your computer. All right, and from here, you go to the Google Plus image, okay, which is right here, and that's it. So if you want to add your logo, you could simply put this in the publisher, add your logo, and that's how you do it. Okay, so that's pretty simple as well. Let's move on to something a little more challenging. Actually, it's not that challenging. Let's just go to Pinterest, okay? And so Pinterest.com, and hopefully you have a Pinterest page, and this is what it looks like, and I'm going to go to add a pin. So what I want to do first, though, okay, is I'm going to go back to my, I'm going to I'm going to do one of those links I showed you, okay? But I'm going to go back to my website, and I'm going to offer 
some type of free trial or something. So here's my free trial lesson that I have on my website. Okay, and what I'm going to do here is I'm going to link this to that banner. So I copy the, the I copy this right here. All right, now let's go back to Pinterest and let's add a pin. So let's add a pin, upload a pin. All right, and we're going to do one of those infographs. So let's go to desktop. All right, let's see what infograph we want to use. Let's do the one about is your child a bully? Let's try that one. Okay, so th th there you go. Now I upload it just as simple as that. I'll go to my Champions Martial Arts Turnersville page. Okay, and I will say, uh, is your child a bully? Click the image. Okay, so is your child a bully? Click the image for improving his or her self-control. I was going to say for for help to help them, but that, that sounds like you know whatever. So I just go here like this. Let's pin it. Okay, now watch this. I have a nice infograph on Pinterest. Okay, and then I go here to edit. All right, let's see why this is working? Why it's not working? Give it a second here. There we go. Okay, so now let's go back. Bless you. Okay. Now it's not it's not letting me like uh, set up a link here, so let's just put it down here at the bottom. So normally it would, and I, but for, that's a Pinterest thing. So I'll just go here like this. I'll put the link here, free trial, and put it just right there. There's always a way around somewhere, and just go post comment. So you ca can't comment on this pin. That's kind of weird. It's not letting me do it. But anyway, that's what it should it should let me do it, but it's not for some reason. All right. So let's see why. Edit. Let's try it again. Upload a pin. Let's try a different one. Let's just double check here, see what's going on. And you have to be patient. If something doesn't work, it's not the end of the world. It could be some kind of glitch with the, with the program. So let's go Champions Martial Arts Turn as well. Just so there's something like that. Pin it. Hopefully it works this time. Okay, it's pretty good. That, this time it let us do the link. So then I, now I put the link right here and then save it. You usually can't use bit.ly links in this for some reason. Okay, so just be, be aware of that. If you're not sure what a bit.ly link is, it's just a link shortener. So then watch. So now someone on, on Pinterest is reading this about what is bullying. They click it, and where does it take them to? Back to my website. That's referral traffic. So if you don't have the right content, no one cares. All right? So this is what you need to do for Pinterest. That's how you can do it. Now I can take the same image, go to Facebook, let's go to my champions page. All right, so let's see here. Look at Sensei Brooklyn there. Wow, Sensei Brooklyn. Shout out to Sensei Brooklyn. And let's add this image on Bully Awareness Month on our my champions page. So let's go to photo. Let's do cyberbullying. Register here. It would be cool if you could link the picture on Facebook, but you can't. And just go to post. Give it a second. Click it. And there's your, you know, it looks a little bit better in this way. And then tag people. Tag so that's how other people see it. Tag the people that you know are interested. Tag local business owners, some people that you work with. That's why building a network is important because then, like for example, a versus bakery. That's a, a bit, one of the biggest bakers around in my area. I could post things on their Facebook page all the time, and I and I help them get more likes. 
So they went from like zero likes, they're breaking in on a thousand right now. And if you look at this, here's an example, the versus bakery. So this is like you know, there's a, this is an amazing bakery, Sean. Hopefully we get you there next time you come out for this. This place is Ricardo made his favorite place when he comes to my office. As you, as you can see, it might not be the healthiest, but that's a Oreo cake. And look at this Champions Anniversary cake that they made for me. This is a cupcake cake. Last week was my 12 year anniversary. So what I do is I go on my Facebook page and I tell everybody to like their page. So I mean, this place, look at this crumb cake, pies, everything you can imagine. Some Italian uh, you know food over here. It's just amazing. The best rolls and bread. So you have to work with people that are big in your town. This bakery is huge. They've been around for like 30 years, and I'm helping them. We're actually they're actually one of our Champions Way clients. We do their website. We do everything for them. So you have to work with people, and then that way you can promote each other. So that's one another example. So we covered Pinterest. We covered let's see what else we covered here. We did Facebook. We did Google Plus. Uh, tagging people. Okay, we did all that. Uh, let me take it back to uh, let's see here. Facebook. We did. All right, and let's go where, where all the content is. All right, so let's go to championsway.com. I'm actually on Groupon right now, too. My school's actually, we're doing a Groupon kickboxing promotion. So let's see here. Close some of these tabs for a second. All right. All right, so there, I have these tabs up here now for the free bully prevention kit. So what I did was I made a page here, okay, and you could do something very simple like this, okay. So you take the image, you go to click here for your free bully prevention kit. It takes you to the PDF, and this is it. So you download it, and right here, here is the the free bully prevention kit. They have it in the PDF. It's all there for you, okay. So that's how you can do it now, or you can take the other approach, which is doing that and then asking for their information first. It's up to you how you want to do that. All right. So that is. Let me go back here. And here's the cool part, like I was showing you about Perfect Mind. So if I here's here's the desktop version. Now if I click this, all right, I also have it in the mobile. So if someone's on my mobile site, they're going to see this. They're going to see the actual same image, okay? But it's going to fit into the mobile. Huge. It's powerful. So that's how that works, okay? So that's that's pretty much the bully prevention kit. We covered uh, pretty much everything. Uh, the hardest thing I believe it would be the text message, but text messaging, and I'll be doing that tomorrow in the SMO meeting. Uh, but, and then you'll see that basically this is the best way to get started with everything to do with bully awareness. Okay, uh, so let's see here. My last thing for everybody today would be to do some questions. Let me go back to the room here. And if there's any questions about anything you'd like me to show you how to do, I could do that as well. But for now, let's open up the forum for some. Any questions? Hopefully you got some great content. I won't go too long today. Be here for three hours. All right, and let me just get over here. Sensei Lorenzo asked, uh, which is the best blogger site to go to? The best blogger site to go to. Well, personally, like, well, I mean, if you're, I mean, I would use the Lounge because it's on your website, and use that blog for Champions Way. Um, I don't blog as much as I should. You know, I mean, it's it's, it's very time consuming. Uh, but what I like to do is I like to when I do a blog, I recommend Lorenzo actually making it on your site and then submitting it to actually dig. That's that gets you. And Sean, I'm sure you could even expand on that. I know you do a lot of submissions to directories, but that will help them get their blog found a lot more. Uh, so I recommend you know everything I use is Perfect Mind, a power by Perfect Mind. That's that's the biggest the thing that I found is having everything in one place. So my lounge right here, I'd be using this blog. You know, because it's 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 all on your website. Um, if you want to do extra work and then use you know a uh, blogger or you know just uh, you know Tumblr, any type, anything that's a blog, uh, you can do that. But then it's like more work. It's a different website. So I recommend using the, the the blog here. That's my my personal opinion. I agree. I agree. I think it's a great way to choose also bring traffic back to your own website without having to manage it in different places. And Sean, I know your school, if we bring up champions, it seems like you're a little bit more active or a lot more active uh, than my school as, as far as blogging, using lounge. I, I, I always see posts on Facebook. I'm working on it, but again, if you look at our, our, our sites are, are similar. Mine's just a little bit older, <laughs> and uh, Sean's site is, is amazing. And I think, you're, Sean, how many leads a month are you generating right now off of your website? We get about 30 to 40 leads a month from our website. Awesome. 
Yeah, yeah, this looks great. And Sean, I got a surprise for you. I'm getting a new website tomorrow. Oh, I can't wait to see. <laughs> so, I, yeah, I was getting a lot of people were killing me because they're like, "What's going on with your website?" I'm like, "I had the first social site, I think you know, and I, uh, you know, it was very busy when we started. Everyone moved to social site, so it's been about a year, and now it's time for the new one. And but, Sean, your website, if you look at this, guys, this is I love the 30 day trial in any program. It's very professional. Everything Sean does is always very clean and perfect, you know. So it's got a schedule on there. Definitely, if you're looking at a site, you know, I recommend checking this one out. Uh, and then and give me a week. Once my new site's up, I'm sure um, everybody's going to want to take, take a look at my site. But uh, that's uh, that's pretty much it. Right on. Okay. Now the next question was, I have to scroll all the way back up. Um, how do you or where do you let bully victims know that you will sponsor a child for, the, for classes? Well, bully, bully victims, like when they're, a lot of times you're going to start getting calls coming in. Like it was pretty much out of control at our school, like when we started promoting everything and doing the emails. And the, ch the children's parents would call and say that their children are being bullied. Uh, and the first thing is we wanted to get them in for the bully awareness seminar. We did it, we do it every, fr every Saturday at 1 o'clock. That's the bully awareness seminar. Um, and then really it's kind of hard to determine at that point that you're going to sponsor them until you get them in. They come in for the class. Um, you know, because I don't go for the, I don't, you know, I'm sure Sean might, you know, have a different way of doing it, but Sean, what I do is like, you know me, I'm a little bit, I, I like to get them in first and show them what I'm doing, have them come in for the class, then talk to the parents, so that way it's not like I'm trying to get them right on a program or anything, and if they are getting bullied, I'm only sponsoring children that can't afford it. So like, yeah. you know, I'm not, that, that's the only people I'm sponsoring, is if a child's getting beaten up and abused in school, and they love the seminar, and the parents are crying to me, which has happened before, that, you know, they can't afford it, or they, you know, they they're just having a bad financial situation. They would love to do martial arts. Those are the types of children we sponsor. Yeah, and we do the same thing here too. I think kind of to answer a little bit more directly to Scott is we do. We would let people know again by Facebook, our Twitter, our lounge. We post a lot. We also let our students know to let their friends know that we're holding a bully, uh, bullying awareness or bully uh, prevention seminar. Uh, we find um, the best way to get people in is still like word of mouth from parents to other parents because parents will talk about how their kids are struggling at school. So it's a great way to kind of spread the awareness and let people know that, hey, you know, there, there's this opportunity. And we don't always charge necessarily. Sometimes we do, sometimes we don't for the bully prevention seminar. And then from there, if they qualify for, you know, our, our scholarship, um, which is, again, uh, based on kind of income and what their situation is, then we can put them into a, a full program, which is, is going to kind of help them with their bullying issues. That's a great idea too, Sean. Love it. Okay, I think the next question is, how do I, how do you set up the bully kit on our website so it can be sent? That's from Roger. Sure, no problem. That's a little bit more advanced, but I can go through that really quickly. All right, so let's go to the website. All right, so what you're going to do first is you have to be logged in. You know, obviously, so you're going to log in, and then what you're going to do is you're going to go to settings. And then from here, you go to Pages. And uh, I will be explaining this uh, to everybody in SMO webinars again tomorrow. Sometimes, you know, you, you try to keep up, and I, I, I'm trying to go as slow as I can, but I'll go even slower tomorrow. So you have to go to Pages. And then if you, there's a couple different ways to do it, but I'm going to show you the simplest way. You would actually go to your actually a social site. So you go to a social site, and that's where you'll see all of your pages. So you, what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to click uh, Add a New Page. So you go up here and Add a New Page. So you go to New Page, and then you'll name it Free Bully Prevention Kit. So I, I already made it, so I'm just going to I would pretend like I clicked that, and then it would take me to the actual Free Bully Prevention Kit. So I'll click that, give it a second to load, or I'll have to edit it, I'm sorry. So I'll give it a second. All right, and what I do here is very simple. Keep everything else the way it is, name your page. And you have to go to the Image Manager, which is right here. All right, so you go to Image Manager, and then this is where you would upload the actual JPEG. All right, so then you would go to Upload, Select, and that's where you would select your image, and then you'd upload it right there. Now, I'm not done yet. Okay, after you do that, then what you want to do is you want to save it. Okay, now watch. There's one more thing you want to do here. All right, so I want to go, I want to go back to the page, edit the page. All 
Actually, no. I want to, okay, one more thing, but we, this is what you have to do. You have to go to social site. It'll, you'll now have your tab here. Now, you could change the order of the tabs. That will end up being like a big social site training, so I'm not going to have time to show you how to get the orders correct. But for right now, this is where it would go. All right? Then what you want to do is you also want to go to edit to that on that tab, and you will go to the mobile. So when you go to mobile, you do the same thing. So they give us see that right there, and then that way it fits in when someone's going on the mobile device, it would take them to that. So Sean, I don't know, but that to me is like wherever where you know everyone's doing a lot more mobile marketing. Having this available to you is like huge because. There's nothing worse than, you know, you saw that bully prevention kit, which I didn't have time. I was just, I wanted to share by, like, you know, some innovative stuff. But when it's fitting right into your phone, like, that's going to get, the conversion rates are going to increase probably 40 to 50 percent. When you have to scroll around and make it bigger and smaller, and, that, like, people just lose, you know, everyone's ADD is out of control. Yeah, so no, I agree. Real, you know what I'm saying? Definitely. So, Definitely. Yeah, I love this feature. So, and now, that's only the first part. So, what, I would do both of those, okay? Then what you do is you save it. Okay, and now this is where you put the PDF. You have to go over here like this, and Roger, I'll show you how to do this tomorrow because the PDF I have, I want to have to show you guys how to add it into different pages, and it's going to be a little more complicated, but what you would do is you would go to uh, settings again, and then I would go over here to website hidden pages. Okay, and that's where I put the PDF. All right, so you'll see here it says bully prevention kit. So here is where you would put the, that, that's where it would go. So I would go here to this, edit. And then there's a document manager. I mean, we have everything in Perfect Mind. It's, just, it's a massive. So over here, this is where you upload the PDF. Now, the document manager, you know, uh, you, we might have to condense it. So sometimes it's, you know, we're, we're working on that, getting all those smaller images for you guys tomorrow. I have, I, I have the software to do so. You might not. You might not have the skill set or not knowledge how to do that, but that's how you would do it. Then what I do, okay, this is very important. I can't take the link from here because I'm, I'm, in, I'm in a special place. Uh, you have to make sure you take it from somewhere else. So I'd save the link, okay, like this, okay? And then I would go to, uh, I want to make sure I'm on website hidden pages. And this is, this is the link that you want. Believe it or not, it didn't look different, but it was. This is, this, is the re this is the record that you want. Okay, then what I have to do from here is go to copy. <laughs> and again, we'll be, I'll be training everybody on this again tomorrow. Go back to social site. Go to the bully prevention kit, and you can do both, the mobile and the desktop. Go to edit, and I'm sure people are lost, but it's okay, Sean. Like I said, we'll be going over tutorials on how to do this tomorrow. And then all you do is click this, and you link it. And then you put it right there where the URL is. You save it, and that's how you get the hyperlink to work. So yeah, the important so thing okay. is, guys, sorry, guys, Sean. No, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I was going to say the most important thing is like you know um, you, you have to learn how to do this because like bully prevention is one month like we don't do bully prevention and then that's it like next month we already have a plan we're we're already getting ready uh, getting ready to roll out Halloween safety okay if you're providing content that's interesting to pro to people and prospects and community you could always generate more and more traffic so like not going to know how to do this and we're, we're Champions Way is providing you with all the collateral and the marketing and the systems. You know, but the promotion at the end of the day, and I know Sean agrees with this, it's going to come down to how hard you push it. Sean, if you want to add to that, please, that'd be great. No, I was going to say, I saw uh, Lorenzo and some people say, yeah, this is looking pretty complicated. I think uh, Cynthia Nick's just going through it quickly so he can show you. But if you dedicate, you know, probably even less than an hour, I would say, you could probably learn how to, how to do this, and then it's just a matter of implementing it month after month. Um, but once you just dedicate yourself to learning it, you'll get it pretty quick. Um, and, it, and it works actually actually quite effective. So, um, and since you were saying you're going to be offering some sort of training on this tomorrow or the next day, uh, I will. Yes. Look. Okay, perfect. Tomorrow, two o'clock. Uh, every SMO meeting. That's why it's you know um, so important to attend the meeting, Sean, uh, yeah. because we go over this again and again. And the thing is, like you know, that's part of you know of the, of the coaching program is we're teaching you how to do this, and th this will not be the last. You know, like. From the time we started two years ago, it just keeps building and building and building. So, you know, uh, guys like Grandmaster Charafella, guys, if you want to talk to someone that's just really kicking you know, kick butt, and uh, also Mark Speranza, uh, these guys, you know, they're becoming masters of it. And then the good thing is you're, you're saving so much time because everything's done for you. So, yeah, you're right. About an hour at the most of, like, slow training, you know, and we're going to do some training tomorrow. And then from there, once, once you actually learn it once, 
then it's just going to be just taking the content from the actual Champions Way uh, library and then just utilizing it. So. Okay, yeah. awesome. Fancy. There's a couple more questions, and just in the sure, interest sure. of time, if I move forward. Um, uh, sorry, right here. Uh, Annette said, "This is amazing. Where can I download all the banners, uh, etc.? Or will that be toward the end of the seminar?" Yeah, Annette. The best thing to do would be to um, call Champions Way. Uh, it's uh, eight seven seven. And Sean, if we could maybe put a link in there for this, the number, and you could ask for anyone from the sales department. Uh, yeah. They could help you get set up. Um, and you know, it's 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 a very big and long process, and that like it's that you know is um, this is I know it is really cool and it's awesome. The thing is, this is like a total you know makeover of the way you're doing your marketing. So it's it's a very involved process. We want to make sure your website's set up. We want to make sure you have a mobile website. We want to make sure all your email notifications are working. All your reports are set up. If you don't know where things are coming from, you're wasting your time. So this is like a fraction of what we're doing. So I think that um, you know, it, and understand, it takes about 30 days to get everything going, and then after that, you know, that you're you're really going to be light years ahead of your competitors, you know. So it, you know, and then from there, like with this content getting produced every month, uh, you know, you're going to have you're gonna, the traffic. That's the key, you know. And it, without it's a numbers game. But the difference is before guys was that, you know, you know, you had a lot more walk-ins, and you know, you know, everyone's changed. Like now, people just go online and look. So if you're missing that presence, your numbers are going to drop. So. Definitely contact 877-774-5425, extension 1, and ask for anybody and ask them about SMO. Okay. Awesome. Perfect. Uh, just moving down, Lorenzo also asked, um, so using that with, for SEO purposes as well for the blogger, I think Lorenzo was talking about uh, back then about the blog when you mentioned using the lounge. Um, I don't know if you're okay with that. I can probably feel that question there, Sensei, for the Please, SEO. Sean, I, I think you're more qualified on that one as anyway. Yeah, no worries. Uh, Lorenzo, we use our lounge on purpose just because it adds multiple pages to our website, and all that does is for internal link building within our site, which is a which is an on-page uh, SEO strategy in itself works really well, and because the lounge is it, it, it's a blogging platform, so it's the same thing as WordPress except for it's integrated into your site and your social sites, so you can socially share it to Facebook or Twitter or wherever, and it brings people right back to your website, so. And those pages also become indexed by Google, and they're searchable. So actually, one of our posts when we launched our Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu program about you know two years ago, and we put it on our lounge, it became it was it hit the first page of Google within like seven days, because I didn't have to go and start a whole new website. It was already linked to a site that was existing and uh, ranking very highly. So we started a whole new program, and we were ranking higher than people whose entire school was. Uh, was just about uh, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. So the lounge, as long as your post is optimized properly, the uh, the lounge works very effectively for SEO. Awesome. Awesome. Uh, I think kind of getting towards. Great the clarification answer. too, Sean. That was that was a great explanation. Oh, no worries. Do you suggest making? Uh, this is from Julie. Do you suggest making a tab on your website for the bully kit versus including the kit in your learning center? You know, Jules, uh, and I'm sure, assuming that's Jules Ringden, one of my f favorite clients. That's a great question, Jules. Um, I think, you know, like, I, I, this is a, a new way I did it. And what Julie's talking about, another awesome feature is our learning center. Um, the only thing, Jules, that I recommend is I think the learning center is better for courses. So if, if you look at, like, you know, my website here, and I went to, like, learning center, um, the learning center, when I say courses, like, you could offer an online course. And this is even even more powerful, and we're, we're coaching all of our, our SEO and SMO clients to do this as well. Like, if you're offering a free, a free bully prevention course, that would be more videos and actually like you know like an online course for parents or children to go through, and that's better for courses. I think for a kit, something that's a PDF, I, I think the tab and like having something fresh, especially especially Sean, what you were talking about, having an additional page that's indexed by Google, you know, that, especially for something for bully prevention. That, I think that that's it's probably better for kids to use the actual web page and for courses to use the learning center. Yeah, I agree. Okay, I think um, there's only a few more questions here. How or do you think it would be a bad idea for kids to give my kid cards to go door to door for Halloween safety, or how would I get it into promote it into the school? I'll let you answer that one first, Sean. I want to see what you have to say on that one. How do I think it would be a bad idea to give my kids cards to go? Sending people door to door, I mean, that's 
<laughs> it's funny you're saying <laughs> door to door alone to promote safety. I don't know how safe that is. <laughs> I mean, if they were if they were in a group or with adults or if they're when they're trick or treating, they're handing things out. I mean, that's a different story. I don't know if I'd be sending my kids out door to door prior to that. Um, giving them passes to hand out to their friends or like uh, kick or treat passes, which maybe on one side talks about Halloween safety. It's a Halloween safety seminar that they can take home and give to their parents. I mean, I might promote that way. But again, inside inside the school and online are, are, are hugely important. Um, and even um, offering something to the school, to the school board, to the principal's office, uh, sending them, a, issuing a letter and say, hey, this is what we're offering in the community. It's free to all our kids in the community about uh, about Halloween safety and we're offering at our school if they want to come down. A lot of schools like to get involved with that because they're showing parents that you know they're taking a proactive uh, stance in, in keeping kids safe for Halloween. And it's actually pretty original. Not that many people do it, and not or not that many people really know how to do it. So um, I think those are those are the avenues I would take over over sending my kids out door to door. I don't know about you, Sensei. What do you what do you think? I, I was gonna, I, that's the reason why I asked you because like I know I'm, I never would send my kids door to door, especially. Uh, you've been down to this neck of the woods in Jersey. <laughs> it's, it's definitely uh, sometimes there's some sketchy areas. Like it's really it's interesting. There's some areas where you know it's very nice, and then right around the corner, um, I, I would never have my students do that. So, um, okay. but I mean, if you're you know that's just my opinion. I, I like you know going on foot and going myself personally to the school systems, uh, getting nice yeah. nice polo shirt on, looking professional, uh, going in there and asking if I could speak to the principal or anybody like that. Awesome. At, yeah, and Lorenzo for uh, for trick or treating. Yeah, I think that's okay if they're maybe ha handing it out while they're trick or treating. But outside that, I would say no. Anyway, since I think uh, I think we're getting towards the end. Uh, there, was there anything else you want to go over and cover about? Uh, yes, one well, last thing. One last thing, Sean. First of all, like definitely, uh, Sean's done an amazing job for the Seaway guys. Um, I just I can't I can't tell you enough. It was just uh, thank you so much for everything. Uh, he's done an amazing job. So please oh, visit you. Martial Arts Convention. Uh, dot com and check it out. Uh, Sean, thank you so much, and it's been awesome working with you so far. Awesome. Well, thank you. And then finally, one more thing, Sean, I'm sorry. Uh, we actually, Here's a little test for you guys to check out. Uh, if you would like a free tour of our software, or if you'd like to see what PM3 is, which is our newest version, text free tour to the number 72727. All right? 72727. So again, it's free tour to 72727. And that will give you a video of Perfect Mind 3. And also, if you click on the desktop, uh, the link on the uh, it's called desktop on the second link, that will take you to a free trial, so you can get a free tour of our software and our platform and any of our services. And Sean, that is it for me, man. So thank you so much. Uh, this was one of my most fun webinars in a while with yourself. So thanks again. Oh, awesome! Well, thank you, Sensei. Thank you, thank you. It was, uh, good to be here as always. Amazing webinar. It's awesome. All, always very informative. <laughs>